Laura from laurelondonfitness.com where I help busy women get hot and healthy from any age. So today I've got a great circuit workout for you. What you're going to need are a pair of exercise discs. If you don't have discs, you can use paper plates, plastic plates, or even dish towels. You're gonna to need a loop band. And if you don't have a loop band, don't worry. You can do the exercise without it. A resistance band, uh, a couple sets of pairs of weights, and a mat. Fabulous. Now that we've got that covered, I want to make sure you warm up for five minutes before you start this routine. So go warm up and meet me back here and we'll get started. Okay, are you ready? The first exercise, you're going to need your weights. I've got some eight pound weights here. I'm going to show you what we're going to do. We're going to step back, knee up, step back, knee up. We're going to do that for 20 on each side. So here we go. Ready? Step back, up. One, two, you got it. Three, we're just getting right into this workout. Four, five, six, seven, keeping all the weight on that one leg. Eight, nine, ten, keep it going. Eleven, twelve, 13, 14, 15, five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent, all right, we're gonna take it to the other leg for 20, here we go. Stepping it back, one, boom, two, three, you got it, four, Five, six, I love working out with you guys. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, keep it going, don't stop. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, yes. 19, last one here, 20. Excellent, okay. Okay, now we're gonna go into our alternating curtsy lunge. So a curtsy lunge looks like this when you step behind, step behind. Follow along with me, ready? We're gonna do five alternating and then five stationary, watch. Alternating, one, two, whoops, just stepped on my stuff. Three, four, Five, stay here, up and down. One, two, three, four, five. Whoop, come back up, other side, stationary. One, two, three, four, five. Let's come back up, and now we're gonna alternate for five again. One, two, three, four, and five. Five. Excellent. All right, we're going to move on to our deadlifts. So I call these sliding deadlifts. We're going to keep those weights really close to the body. You're looking forward, a nice flat, flat back, and coming back up. We're going to do 15 here, so let's do them together. Slide it down. Pull up from your glutes. One, a nice booty squeeze up here. Two. Good, that's it, three, I'm watching you. Feel that, four, it's all coming from those glutes. Squeeze the glutes now, boom, five, you know I can't exercise and count, six, good, looking forward, seven, nice flat back, eight, Nine, come all the way up and squeeze. 10, yep. 11, wanna watch you guys. 12, you're doing good. 13, squeeze it up here. 14, and 15, excellent, all right. 
let's put those weights down and now we're gonna pick up a little bit lighter set of weights these are five and we're gonna do 30 seconds of knee pulls so this is great for the core and getting your cardio up where's my timer here we go ready there it is all right high knee pull that knee up pull those weights in really crunch it as if you're doing an ab crunch you can go faster, slower, whatever you need to do for you. It's your workout today, right? You're here, you're doing it. That's all that matters. Come on, we can do this for 30 seconds. Don't stop. Good, yes, we're almost there, I promise. Ha, told ya. All right, put those weights down. And now we're gonna go and we're gonna start back at the beginning. So we started with stepping back and up. We're gonna do 15 this time. Here we go. Back, up. One, two, three. That's it. Four, five, six, seven. Eight, I'll let you catch your breath after this exercise. Nine, 10, 11, 12, yep, 13, couple more, 14, and 15. Excellent, now we're gonna take it to the other side for 15. If this is too much, one, do it with no weights, two, if this is easy, three, add some more, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. You got it. Fourteen. Last one. Woo! Fifteen. All right, put those weights down. Let's catch our breath. Take a sip of water. I got my heart rate up. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're gonna grab those weights. And we're gonna go back into alternating curtsy lunge for five. Stationary curtsy lunge for five. Here we go. One, two. Keep stepping on everything. Three. Four. And five. Now we're gonna stay here for five. One, two, three, four, five. You got it. Alternate here. One, two, three, four, and five. And let's just go one, two. I know I'm counting weird today. Three four, and five. I'm all over the place. Okay, now we're gonna go back into those sliding deadlifts. Ready, here we go, for 10. Slide them down, squeeze the glutes up. One, these are so great. Two, for the back of the house. <laughs> Three, what do I mean when I say back of the house? The booty, the hamstrings, everything back there. I think this is six, seven, come on, squeeze everything. Eight, you got this, come on. Nine, last one here, and 10, just squeeze it all. Okay, awesome. Put those down, grab your lighter weights, and we're gonna go back into the 30 second knee up, weight pull down, here we go. Go! Ready. That's it. Use it. Do it. Work it. I'm here with you doing it today. So you're not alone. Right? If you got one of those big TVs, you can put me up on your TV and do it with me. I love when you guys send me photos of you doing the workout along with me on the TV. It's so cool. Right? Keep it going. Don't stop. Don't stop. All right, after this, 
we're gonna move on to our next circuit. You did it, awesome. All right, on to circuit number two. Okay, now we're gonna get ready to use the sliders. So you're gonna put them down on the floor. These are great because they work on either carpet or a tile floor. So we're gonna put it down and you're gonna grab a weight. I'm gonna grab my heavier weights here. And our toes are gonna go on the slider, watch this. We're gonna squat, slide, slide, and come up. Squat, slide, slide, and come up, staying low. Here we go. Squat, slide, slide, up. Squat, slide, slide, and up. Squat, slide, slide, and up. You got it, keep it going. Keep it nice and low. Boom. Good. Slide it, slide it. If you've never used the discs before, they're great. There's so much that we can do with them. All right. One more to each side. Here we go, boom, boom, and up. And start feeling that in your glutes. I lie, let's go back one more. Here we go. Okay, good, fabulous. All right, now we're gonna need whoop, your resistance band. All right, let's get these sliders out of the way. Step on your resistance band, and we're gonna do band uppercuts for 30 seconds. Here we go, on the clock, really, as fast as you can, keeping the body tight. You're also working your core, biceps, and getting that cardio up there. Come on, you feel it? It's a great exercise, boom, boom, bam. Keep it going, till you hear that timer. Don't give up, mind over matter. You can do anything you put your mind to, ladies, come on. Keep it going. Boom, boom. I promise I set the timer. Okay, awesome. Sometimes I think I don't set the timer. All right, now we're gonna take a lighter weight. I've got fives. I'm gonna kill myself today here. And we're gonna do what I call shoulder shredder. So watch me for this one. I have my feet in a staggered stance, one foot behind the other. We're going up, front, overhead, down, side, and down. It's a lot of moves there. You really need to start with a light weight until you get stronger with these. We're gonna do 10 of them, here we go. One. Two. Whenever you bring those weights over your head, you are engaging your core. And you see how I'm lowering slowly? I'm in control of the weights. The weights are not in control of me, right? I'm gonna say this is five. <laughs> Hope you guys are counting. Six, good, keep it going. Starting to feel them. I know you are. Seven, usually by eight, it starts to get hard to get them over your head. Eight, beautiful, don't stop. Nine, Ah, oh, good, and last one here. You might want to start with one pound, three pounds, whatever works for you. All right, woo, roll those shoulders out. All right, make sure you have some room so you're not tripping. Now we're gonna do 30 seconds of squat hop. So squat hop is touching the ground, hopping up. Okay, if you can't squat or jump, just run in place, jog in place. Just keep moving for 30 seconds. Ready? Here we go. I like to start down here. On your mark, get set, go. Just keep it going. Hope my microphone doesn't fall off. You can hear me. Keep it going. We can alternate our hands if you want. That's it. You can give me a clap in the middle. Give you a high five. Whatever. Miss Mary Mac. Remember that? <laughs> Dating myself. Here we go, keep it going. That's it, you got it. Don't stop. Keep it going. Go. Boom. Boom. 
Yes, we did it. All right, catch your breath, grab some water, because we're gonna do that again. Whew. Those 30 second cardio moves always get me. All right, let's get those sliders back. Get your weight and our toes are going on the tops of the sliders. We're squatting, slide, slide, up and squeeze everything. Slide, slide, squeeze, that's two. Slide, slide, three, slide, slide, four, good. Slide, slide, five, slide, slide, six, keep it low. Slide, slide, seven, slide, slide, eight, two more. Slide, slide, nine, and squeeze it, and slide, slide, 10. Woo, losing my voice. All right. I'm getting a workout today for sure. All right. Now we're gonna go into our band uppercuts again. Stand on that band. Get ready, cause here we go. Boom. That's it. Uppercut. They're staying close to your body. They're not way out here. They're right here. Look at that. Slight bend in my knees. Core is nice and tight. Those abs are engaged. Woo! Oh my gosh, I'm feeling this one. Keep it going, ladies. Keep it going. And then we're gonna go back into that shoulder shredder. Woo! Squat hops, and then we'll be done with this circuit. Here we go. Bam! Okay. Throw them down. Give me some arm circles. Couple forward. Couple backward, all right. Let's get our weights, the lighter weights for the shoulder shredders. Nice staggered stance. And here we go for 10. One, two, I know you like this one, don't you? Three, good, four, overhead. Woo, I'm feeling it. Five. These are great for your shoulders. Six. We could be on seven. I don't know. Seven. Eight. Yes. Two more. Two more. Don't stop. If you need to, give yourself a little shoulder roll and finish those last two. One, slow, boom, boom. And last one here, overhead, nice and slowly down, side and down. Oh wow, really, really good. All right, put those down. Shake out that sho those shoulders, that two of them. We're gonna go into 30 second squat hops for our last round here. Ready? Here we go, 30 seconds are on the clock now. That's it. Keep it going, move it around. If you wanna move around your room, whatever you wanna do, just keep it going. I'm doing it with you so you're not alone. <laughs> we can do anything together. Wow. Good, almost there, almost there. I know we're more than halfway there. Good, come on timer. Yes, I knew it. All right, that was excellent. You did great. Now we're gonna move on to our last circuit. I told you we were working out today. Okay, this is our last circuit and now we're gonna take one of our heavier weights and we're gonna do some plie squats. So our toes are pointed out, not all the way sideways, but just a little bit. We're gonna hold that weight. We're gonna go down our body, I'm gonna show you from the side. It's gonna stay straight 
and our knees are pushing outward over our toes, right? One, we're ballerinas. Two, squeeze that booty when you come up. Three, four, five, really concentrate on those knees going out. Six, seven, eight, squeezing the booty. Nine, working those inner thighs. 10, 11, 12, 13, we're gonna do 15, 14, and 15. Okay, great. Now, I'm gonna take, I think, my lighter weight, and we're gonna do a side lunge. So I want you to feel this here. And we're gonna come back up, and we're gonna bring those weights up. We're gonna do five on one side, five on the other. Here we go. Side lunge, overhead. Side lunge, overhead. That's two. Control those weights. Three. Four, good. And five. I'm gonna move over here so you can see me. Now we're gonna five side lunges to the other side. Side, one, good. Side, really lunge it. Two, three. Let's wait till those weights come down before we lunge. Four, last one here. And five. Excellent. Okay, now I got my cheat sheet here. All right, now we're gonna roll out the mat. Unless you're on carpet, but you might want something just for your knees. Let's roll that mat out. Let me make sure you guys can see me. I think you can. Okay, we are going to take the band. I love these loop bands. There's so many things we can do with them. They're awesome. We're gonna wrap them around our feet. You see that? They're here. Then we're gonna flip over. We're gonna get into a push-up position, and then we're just gonna bring the knees in, alternating them for 20. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, you got it, nine, 10, make sure that core's tight, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, drop it to your knees. Give me a nice child's pose stretch. And then take the band off and come up slowly. Always when you're coming from a down position to up, go slow. We do not want you to have orthostatic hypotension, which just means you've gotten up too fast. Okay, so our last exercise here, one of my favorites. My legs are in a staggered stance. My arms are straight up. We're pushing out for 10. Just follow along with me. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Drop it down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I want you to see one, two, what these bands do. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Drop it down in front of you. One, two, look at all the muscles working. Three, four, five, everyone, six, should be doing this exercise. Seven, eight, nine, ten. It looks easy. Is it easy? Yeah, you know it's not. All right, now we're gonna put it behind and we're gonna do ten here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, those are killer. All right, take that band and just stretch to one side, stretch to the other. 
Give me some arm circles forward. We're not done. Arm circles back. Don't worry, we are not done. We have to do that whole thing one more time. So grab your weight. We're going into the plie squat. Our toes are pointed out. We are a ballerina. Core is nice and tight, and we're just going down and up. Squeezing one for 15, two, three, four, five, that's it. Six, seven, don't think about what you have to go do. Eight, finish this workout now. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, good. 15, all right, stay here. Put that weight down. Hands on your hip. Come on down, I'm gonna throw this in. We're gonna pick, I want you to come down into that plie squat, but pick this toe up for 10. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Now both of them, one, two, three, four, you got it, five, yes, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, woo, did you feel that? I know you did. All right, let's stretch that out. Before we go on to our next exercise, I'm gonna get some water. I'm very thirsty today. Mm -mm -mm. Always good to hydrate. You can see all my hydration creations on my Facebook page and my Instagram page and my website. <laughs> okay, grab your heavier weights. I've just been throwing everything around today. We're gonna go back into those side lunges and overhead. You know what? I'm gonna grab my little bit lighter weight through this one because we're going overhead. All right, here we go. Five side lunges, side and overhead. One, we're almost done with this workout. Two, you guys have done a great job. Three, lunge it. Four, last one on this side for the day. And five, great. I'm gonna move over here. Here we go to the other side. Lunge it. Boom. One. Two. If you lasted this far, three. Let me know it by leaving a comment below. Four. I love hearing the comments. Last one here. And five. Woohoo! And what is our last exercise? Oh, sorry, two more. Let's, uh, all right, we're gonna go down. We're gonna do that band exercise down here for 20. Band pulls great for the core. Let's do it. If you need to, you can always, I should have told you this before, you can do it on your knees too. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. We're doing 20. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, grab that band, boom, and slowly come on up with me. Good job. Last exercise of the day, I promise. We're gonna start in reverse. I'm gonna start back here for 10. So here we go for 10, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring it in front. We're gonna start down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. We're gonna keep it close to the body. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. My arms are killing me. Straight out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven.
seven, eight, nine, ten, and then last one, lift it over, ten, nine, eight, count it with me, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woohoo! That was great. All right, take that band and just give everything a stretch here and a stretch here. Let's bring those arms, open up that chest, look up to the ceiling, give me some arm circles back. I'm gonna drop my band here. Okay, you did an amazing job. That was not an easy workout. You stuck through it and you did it. If you had a hard time, keep doing it at your own pace and work up and you'll get stronger, I promise. All right, that's it for today, ladies and gentlemen. I love you and I will see you on the next video. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can also shop my Amazon store, which I'll put below, a link below, which links to all my favorite fitness equipment, kitchen equipment, everything that I personally love and use. All right, 10-4 over now. Bye-bye.